Hello and welcome to my channel. I hope you enjoy the story. I'm going to try and upload a new story each day. The Curse Compass In the dimly lit corners of a dusty curiosity shop, nestled between ancient relics and forgotten artifacts, Harry Granger stumbled upon a peculiar item that would change the course of his life forever the Curse Compass. Its ornate design and eerie glow drew him in, as if the compass whispered tales of untold riches and hidden secrets. As a seasoned treasure hunter with a pension for the unknown, Harry couldn't resist the pull of the mysterious compass. Little did he know that this acquisition would plunge him into a nightmarish world beyond his wildest fears. Guided by the eerie needle of the cursed compass, Harry set sail across tumultuous seas, following its erratic spins and twirls. After days of navigating treacherous waters, the compass pointed unwaveringly towards a mysterious, fog-shrouded island. It was a place whispered about only in hushed tones among sailors an island that harbored a treasure so immense it was said to be guarded by malevolent spirits. As the boat scraped against the desolate shore, Harry's excitement mingled with a creeping sense of foreboding. The island, draped in mists, seemed to breathe with a life of its own. The compass led him through dense jungles and winding paths until he reached the heart of the island, a forgotten temple adorned with ancient symbols and carvings. In the dim light of flickering torches, Harry discovered a hidden chamber, the air thick with an otherworldly presence. There, at the center, lay the treasure he sought, a chest overflowing with jewels, gold, and artifacts of unimaginable value. But as Harry reached for the bounty, a voice echoed through the chamber, chilling him to the bone. Who dares disturb the sacred guardian of this treasure? The voice, resonating from the shadows, belonged to a spectral figure that materialized before him. The vengeful entity, bound to protect the riches at any cost, revealed itself as a tormented soul with hollow eyes that bore into Harry's very soul. The ghostly figure spoke of a curse that bound it to the island, demanding the terrible sacrifice to release both it and the treasure from their eternal imprisonment. The choice was laid bare before Harry sacrifice a part of himself or face the wrath of the Guardian, condemned to a fate worse than death. As the compass glowed brighter, pulsating with an ominous energy, Harry hesitated. The Guardian's whispers echoed in his mind, urging him to make the choice. In a moment of desperation, Harry made the fateful decision, severing a piece of his own soul to appease the vengeful entity. The moment the sacrifice was made, the island trembled, and the guardian faded away, its mournful wails lingering in the air. The treasure chest, now unguarded, opened to reveal its dazzling contents. But Harry, forever changed by the ordeal, found no solace in the riches before him. Haunted by the ghostly presence, Harry sailed away from the accursed island with a hollow victory, the cursed compass now a constant reminder of the price paid for untold wealth. As he sailed into the horizon, the fog enshrouded the island once more, hiding its secrets from the prying eyes of those who dared to seek the cursed treasure. The journey back to civilization was plagued by an unsettling stillness. The once vibrant seas now seemed listless, and the wind whispered tales of the soul that Harry had sacrificed. The cursed compass, now an ominous relic in his possession, continued to pulsate with an unsettling glow, as if it held a connection to the guardian he had left behind. Night after night, Harry's sleep was invaded by haunting dreams. The Guardian's hollow eyes bore into his subconscious, accusing him of the pact they had forged. Shadows danced on the periphery of his vision, and disembodied whispers echoed through the cabin of his ship, a constant reminder of the price he had paid for the cursed treasure. As the days turned into weeks, Harry's physical and mental well-being deteriorated. The lines on his face deepened, and his once vibrant eyes dulled with the weight of guilt and remorse. The cursed compass, a malevolent force that seemed to feed on his anguish, led him on an aimless journey through treacherous waters and desolate islands, each more foreboding than the last. In a moment of desperation, Harry sought the guidance of a wise old sailor known for his knowledge of the supernatural. The sailor, with withered hands and a grave expression, examined the cursed compass and revealed the chilling truth the guardian's curse was not easily broken. The sacrifice Harry had made was eternally bound to the compass, ensuring that the guardian's presence would forever haunt him. Determined to free himself from the torment, Harry embarked on a quest to find the source of the curse. The compass led him to forgotten temples, cursed caverns, and desolate landscapes, each step deeper into the supernatural realms. 
Along the way, he encountered malevolent spirits, spectral apparitions, and entities that hungered for the fragments of his shattered soul. As he delved further into the heart of darkness, the guardian's whispers grew louder, echoing through the corridors of his mind. The line between reality and nightmare blurred, and Harry questioned whether he was a mere puppet manipulated by the cursed compass. Finally, in the depths of a long-forgotten catacomb, he discovered an ancient altar adorned with symbols matching those on the compass. The air crackled with malevolent energy as he realized that breaking the curse required a sacrifice greater than he had ever imagined. Haunted by the tormented spirit of the Guardian, Harry faced an excruciating choice to surrender the entirety of his soul to the Guardian or to be forever tormented by its relentless presence. The compass, now throbbing with an insatiable hunger, seemed to demand the ultimate price. In a moment of agonizing decision, Harry relinquished the remnants of his soul to the altar. The catacomb trembled, and the guardian's spectre materialized before him. With a mournful gaze, the guardian faded away, leaving Harry alone in the oppressive silence of the catacomb. As the curse lifted, the cursed compass lost its malevolent glow, becoming an ordinary artifact once more. Yet the cost of Harry's pursuit of untold wealth was etched into his very being. Emptied of his own essence, he sailed away from the accursed catacomb, haunted by the echoes of his choices, forever adrift on a sea of regret. The cursed compass, now devoid of its supernatural power, lay in the hands of the broken treasure hunter, a chilling reminder that some treasures exact a price far greater than the riches they promise. The seas whispered of his tale, a cautionary story carried by the winds to those who dared to seek the forbidden and unlock the horrors that lay hidden in the shadows of their desires. Thank you for listening, I hope you enjoyed the story. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.